So the crew continuing to go over the Napa number 49 down in the work area. Chase Rodman, have they found anything significant yet? No, everything looks fine. It looks like they made an air pressure adjustment on the left rear tire. That's about all they did down here on Brad Sweet's car. But a guy I want you to kind of maybe pay attention to here, John, is Kerry Madsen. He started way back, I believe, in 13th. And on this restart, should be up to sixth place. Uh, the former Kings Royal winner and multi-time winner here with the Outlaws is on the move in that Tony Stewart Racing Curb Records number 14 car. And did they or did they not change engines after their driving heat race this evening? I believe that's a fresh power plant under the hood. Yeah, quite a few people have actually changed engines so far here tonight. I know Darren Pittman changed one. I believe James McFadden did, and I believe Zach Hampton did. So, been a lot of in, uh, engine changes uh, here in the last couple of days. But, yeah, Kerry Madsen definitely uh, on the move here in that number 14 car. First time out uh, this weekend, and we talked to him earlier on here in the pit area. He was very excited to be behind the wheel of that famous race car, and he's making the most of it right now. Chase, I want to ask you about tire wear as you look at that Napa number 49. Now, we saw the flat right rear tire on the 1S for Logan Shuhart, but that was due to contact with the outside retaining wall. What do the tires look like on the cars that you've been able to see? Well, John, I'm not really an, an expert here, but, I mean, it doesn't look absolutely terrible for running, I believe, what, 15 or so laps. Tires don't look absolutely awful here. Uh, the Casey King guys are taking a look and seeing what they look like, and uh, not to, not too bad here. And I have been trying to pay attention to see if there's any smoke blowing off the right rear. I haven't really seen that here uh, throughout this feature, so I think these guys are, are in pretty decent shape to make it to the end of the race. Thank you, Chase. Here is the running order when we go back to green flag action. Sheldon Hodges.